And meteorologist Angie Lastman for the forecast. Angie, good morning. How's it looking out there? Good morning, Jonathan. No surprise. We've got more severe weather to talk about today. And it's already ramped up this morning across parts of the Midwest. That's the spot that we're going to look for the most impactful weather through the day today. But notice the thunderstorm watch that is in effect extending across this region, Omaha and Kearney, Nebraska, in that severe thunderstorm watch at this hour. By the time we get into the afternoon and evening hours, though, this is going to ramp up. We've got a big system that's working its way to the east and going to be problematic through the day today. It includes more more than 40 million people and notice the bullseye right over Kirksville, Des Moines and Davenport, but it extends from Green Bay to Minneapolis to Minneapolis down to Springfield, in, including St. Louis as well. We're mainly concerned about those strong uh, winds, 60 miles per hour or higher, but up to 90 miles per hour is on the table. But notice the area, the large area that we could see some of those stronger tornadoes. So EF twos or greater for Des Moines, Davenport and Kirksville once again. But the tornado risk is quite expansive across this region through the evening hours tonight. That system will start to move a little farther to the east and then that means Texas to Ohio is going to be our area we'll watch tomorrow for the strong storms to develop and all of those same kind of impacts will be on the table but the bullseye will be Dallas to Little Rock including Memphis and points north of that. Uh, the hail risk will also be there two inches in diameter or higher. On top of that of course we've got the heavy rain too and, and we've got these flood watches already up. Eight million people included in this across parts of the Midwest. We likely will see the flooding concerns specifically flash flooding concerns from Duluth down to Waterloo. Green Bay and Sioux City also included in that through the day today and notice how much rain we're expected over the next couple of days as we get through Thursday over an inch across the Midwest but notice parts of Oklahoma Texas and uh, Arkansas that's where we're going to be watching for the potential of one to two inches so flooding and strong storms all on the table and we've even got some warm temperatures across the board ahead of this system all right we'll be watching that Angie Lastman thank you as always